What's up, small town barbecue? How's your Friday? I'm all right, man. Um, I'm all right. Look red in the face. Must be that fucking light. It's gotta be the light. You're not red. <laughs> What's up, Jason Savage? What's up, buddy? Doing any barbecue this weekend? Um, no, actually, I'm going to tell you guys here in a little bit what we're actually going to do. We're not doing any barbecue this weekend. Um, we got some other stuff on the books, so. Thumbs up, guys. Five of you hit them thumbs up. Thanks for everybody stopping by. It's kind of a uh, unannouncement, you know. Unannouncement. It's like, you eat mud bugs? No, I don't eat mud bugs. I don't eat crawfish. Um, what's up, R and B? Small town though. I don't eat. I don't eat that shit. Sorry about that. I don't eat that. Now, if I'll, I'll eat at least in Alaskan can. Look at you. Look at big sexy. Well, thank you. I got my shit cut. I'm all nice and look. Mm-hmm. So, so guys, you know, it's been a minute. Um, got a couple things happening in life, man. You know, uh, life hits you. Life hits you pretty hard. So we got some things. Got some things. Going to Daytona? No. Not going to Daytona. You gonna be a daddy? No. Oh, hell no. No, I'm already a daddy, but... We can't have no more kids. Well, she can't have more kids. That's good. Right? <laughs> yeah. 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 No more kids. I, I got plenty. Thanks. Anyway, what's what's happening is um I decided to do a live chat tonight because I got some new products out um for swag for our barbecue team. And um I'm gonna plug a friend of mine that started his little on the side business. What's up, Nate? That's up, John. Um, so we are got some things to announce. We're going to go tomorrow to pick up some something new. Well, not new, new brand old, something new to us. So <laughs> there's a couple announcements and stuff, but um, you know, waiting for everybody to get kicked up here. Um, <laughs> chatting with Booger. Booger's live now. I guess I won't. I won't. Like already, audience will be thin. Yeah. So what's up, Two Step? What's up, buddy? Down there and in the awesome country. So anyway, for the whole four of you, this will be an announcement for you. You may see that um, I've slimmed down a little bit. Um, I got high blood pressure. So we're fixing to eat a little better here on the river. But we're still going to barbecue. We're still going to grill. But, um, you know, it's not going to be into the magnitude that it was. So we got barbecue competition season coming. I'm going to be more worried about putting out maybe a cooking video um, once a week, maybe. But I'm going to concentrate on them competition videos. Because um, last year I tried. And, you know, when you get there, you got all the time in the world to tape and film and do everything you want to do. Um, I have high blood pressure myself. Well, John, I'm telling you, it sucks. It really sucks because... I never had nothing wrong with me. And um, as far as, you know, a little fucked up in the head maybe sometimes, but, you know, um, but never had any blood pressure issues. Never, I'm not, I don't have sugar. My cholesterol is fine. Um, but we had a little bit of a moment last week. So uh, where I really fell into a depression hole because of having the high blood pressure and just recently losing my mother to her illness um, her infection, um, cause of her cancer surgery, um, it put a toll on me mentally and I broke down. I lost 21 pounds in three days. So now we're on some blood pressure medicine and, um, working through life. I lost 21 pounds and, uh, I look, I, I can see it in my face. Mm -hmm. Plus I got some of the hair cut off me, look a little thinner maybe. It's all head, right? So, I mean, what I was thinking, um, <clears throat> Same here, 1984. I've been taking, I've been taking, uh, I've taken herbs that helped after just one month. I hear um, an indica blend of the of the of the herbs uh, helps out. <laughs> um, so yeah, John, I'm, I'm just on blood pressure medicine. Uh, I started a new medicine today. I'm on three pills. We're trying to get under control, but I went and starved myself. Um, so I put my body through some hell, had some aches and pains, and. Um, you know, good, you know, small town barbecue. I tell you, man, you know, I didn't know, 
I really did not know what's going on, Lewis Calamatis. My new Facebook friend. What's going on, buddy? Fist pound. Um, yeah, I really um, didn't know. Um, you know, I, you know, I'm a little stupid with the high blood pressure, man. Lord knows how long I've had it. So uh, I've been felt felt a little weird and went to the doctor. Miss Katie was on me for ever since I met her to go to the doctor. Um, you can nail my name every time. Well, how can I not? I was say, I'm I'm pretty good with names. Mister Lewis Calamatis. Take blood pressure pill too. Lay off the salt and drink water. Um, actually, you know, um, I'm not. I can't lay off the salt, man. I tried that shit. Um, my muscles hurt. Um, I'm just recovering from that kind of stuff. Um, and, um, Jason Savage, he works with me. He knows exactly what I've been going through. Um, cause I, you know, we're a big family there and he, it's tough. It is really tough. So, um, I've been drinking plenty of water. Um, but my body needs, still needs some salt intake. Um, so salt, sugar, dairy, UC salt, natural salt. You know, we're, um, Cutting back on some of the rubs, um, but we're we're doing it right. We're gonna do it right. Uh, I was just feeling peaked, um, not from eating, John. I was starving myself, and I was deprived of my body of um, just salt. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm all right. Thanks, Lewis. Um, you know, it's all right, man. It's all right. I used to be a lot sweatier, um, but yeah, hey, whatever, man. Um, I'm actually liking the fact now that you're not complaining that you're too hot. <laughs> well, sometimes it gets a little warm in here. Miss Katie's not made of much, so she, you know, she, uh, you know, I'm 300 pounds. Um, so, you know, stop with the sweet drinks. Plenty of water plus major stop blowing gaskets. Yeah. Um, I've stopped a lot of things. Um, one thing I stopped was a recreational activity. Um, I didn't drink. I kept it natural. You guys can use your imagination. Um, I stopped that. I stopped uh, a lot of stuff. Um, so, but whatever. So, we'll get under control. And um, um, I didn't know that starving yourself and eating not right, not eating at all, will drive your blood pressure up. So, on top of having high blood pressure, losing my mind, and I'm going to have anxiety um, I was worrying myself to death about it, really was, and not eating. So I talked to a good buddy today um, that works with us as well. Uh, he has high blood pressure, and um, Jim Croner, wow, you just a uh, heart attack, huh? Well, that sucks, man. Um, yeah, I'm not planning on having a heart attack. I mean, we're. We got her under, I mean, we're getting her under control. Um, but today's probably, uh, right now is probably the best I've felt because I've actually been starving myself. So guys, if you have blood pressure, high blood pressure, it don't mean you just can't, you can't, you just gotta stop the saturation of salt. Um, you can still have doses of salt. It makes sure, like John said, drink water and your diuretics will pull the salt and out of your muscles and make everything sore. But you gotta stay up on it because literally, literally, I was starving myself. And you can ask Jason Savage, you can ask Katie. Uh, I literally went from 4,000 calories probably a day to 1,000, 1,500. And I learned that my organs were hurting and I'm recovering. So I had to eat. And you got to have some salt. Can't cut it all out. Oh, now, you guys, yeah. now, you guys that are way up there and, and, you know, have worse blood pressure than me, I'm sure it's out there. Um, like in the two hundreds and one nineties and stuff like that, you may want to watch it. Um, but you know, you can't starve yourself. You have to be able to intake stuff. So I lost three years ago. If you don't know me right before I started my YouTube channel, um, <laughs> I watch you shrink over a weekend. Yeah. You know what? My organs, my organs are telling me, um, sea salt or pink salt much better well we have pink salt so we have himalayan salt we have all that sea salt stuff here on grinders so um like tonight we had uh chicken tenders miss katie baked them in the oven and she put a little garlic a garlic powder onion powder a little bit of salt 
and some black pepper because I literally haven't had any salt, like none, hardly. So, and I felt it. So the doctor didn't say go on a diet. She just said cut back. So I cut back he extremely. Hit he, he hit the basement instead of just going down a floor. Yeah, I took it to the extreme, and my body is telling me that I'm a fucking idiot, and I shouldn't have done that. Because three I mean, years ago, before I got with Katie, I literally weighed 380 pounds, and I lost 40 pounds in about six months. But this time, I lost 21 pounds in three days. That was a bit of a shock. So, um... So it showed you how much fluid um, I was carrying. Um, um, so anyway, enough about that. Let's get off the high blood pressure. I feel my fucking shit starting to sweat. So I don't want to talk about it no more. And I get really... Since my mother died, I mean, I've always had a quick temper. You know, I've always been, wham, I'm pissed. Um, but... I got to control that. Uh, they got me on some meds that helped me control my anxiety. And my anxiety got real bad when my mother got sick. And it drove me crazy. Because I miss her still. And when I get, I get talking about her, I get crying, I get a little moist. And I got to stop it. And I feel my, I get a little anxiety. So. I'm sorry, baby. Anyway. Um, I had the pleasure of talking to Scott Sinet. Scott, if you're on here, I haven't seen you pop up yet. Um, thanks for, you know, conversation. Uh, it was awesome. Um, so, my fucking back's hurting in this goddamn chair. I don't have any other... Fucking chair. I don't man. have any... I can put a pillow behind your back. Uh, if that's all I can do. I don't think that old yet. Yeah, sure you are. If you're already complaining about your back, let's get... Home. Well, I mean, I'm, I, I just, I'm saying, man, my kidneys were hurting earlier today, and I finally started eating. Brother Rich, your team ready for comps? And you know what? Let's get there. Yeah, let's go ahead and get to the fucking chase, John. I'm tired of talking about this shit. All right, now this is the shit right here. You're gonna get because I'm not fucked up in the head. I'm not. I was smoking. I'm not gonna tell you. You know, I wasn't smoking crack, but I, I'm. I'm cleaned up a whole lot in the last uh, week and two weeks, week and a half. Um, if you can, uh, up in the hour early, brisk. Brisk walk for the three minutes and a day lost my folks. Years ago, wish I could. St you know, yeah, we're gonna start walking. But however, man, it's like yeah. raining and shit and carrying on. Oh man, can you put it back here for me? Baby? I was going to when you grabbed it out of my hand. Oh. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> now I can sound like a fat fuck. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Well, not so much of a fat fucker anymore. But, I mean, yeah. All right, guys. All right, John. Yeah, my compa team is ready to go. We, um, I'll go ahead and tell you one thing tomorrow is we purchased a um, trailer for competitions. It's not, you know, not a barbecue, porch trailer, nothing like that. It is like a 6x12. Um, a guy in New Jersey, um, one of the fellow barbecue teams, um, <laughs> Savage Damn Kid, you're spoiling him. You know what? She's my... She's my new wifey. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, you know, I spoil her, too. You know that well. So, anyway, we're going to go pick up a trailer. It's a 6x12, and it's a, um, I can't remember his barbecue competition name, his team name. Um, shout out to Jersey. That's right. We're going to be up in, uh, we're going to be up in Jersey. Um, who is close? Okay. Who is close to Philadelphia? And go. Um, Lewis Cop. Where in Jersey? Do us call a modest. Don't make me come see your fucking ass. Um, we are going to be Marl, Marlton. Marl, Marlton? <laughs> like Cherry Hill, Marlton, right across the river, I think, from uh, from Philly. So, anyway. All right, yeah. So, we're going to go up there and we're going to pick up a trailer. The guy had, um, uh, smash them thumbs up, guys. Hit that like button for me, please. Um, so... Um, this guy, you know, he had a trailer full of stuff. I mean, smoker, you name it. He's, it's in there. So what we're going to do is we're going to go pick it up. Yeah, but I asked the girl to get to work. Uh, get to, uh, to work early. I'm hoping to get to the bathroom. Okay, cool. That was just come on confirmation that we're good to go. To really pick up the, definitely to pick up the trailer tomorrow. I mean, we were, but yeah. Oh yeah. Cherry Hill's about an hour south of me. Well, Lewis, we're going to be, we're going to be, 
fucking there early because we can't pick it up till 4.30 because the guy's busy. So um, do me a favor. Hit me on Facebook Messenger when we get done the live chat and we will chat about hooking up. Okay, I definitely want to. Because I'm going to do a video going to get it. Um, I just realized you're Katie. <laughs> really, Savage? That's a blonde man. Are you drinking? <laughs> Don't be dancing by yourself. Anyway, all right. Stay tuned. Anyway, so we're going to go there and get that. So I got a good deal on it. You know, we're going to go get it. So that's that's that. We are got a new canopy. We got a lot of new stuff for the barbecue team. We are ready to go. And the practice cook I had on the 9th um, had some new ribs. Uh, had to get used to cooking the ribs. Um, got a good deal on pork, and the, they love the brisket. So... With that being said, um, we're going to go pick up a trailer tomorrow, and we're going to make a video of it, and that's going to be that. So, oh, and guys, I'm going to show you our new merch. I just put, now get this down. Honey, you want to put that up for me? I got the, I got to start a coupon for this live chat. Okay, I'm running a 10% live chat, on a live chat, until the whole weekend. We're on a 10% this weekend, and it's, River Fun 2019. Um, and we got some new stuff. And you got to put it exactly like uh, Katie put on her, else you won't be doing nothing. All right. We have our new stickers. Okay. And they're good quality stickers. Right here. You can get those. I mean, I, I hate to charge for these things, man, but. You know, two dollars and fifty cents on our website. You know what the hell? So then you get these, or you know, right there. The wind's picking up out there, isn't it? Mm -hmm. So all right. So there's the uh, River Smokers West Virginia Competition Barbecue Team sticker. It's on our website, richesriverbbq.com. Go check them out. Two dollars fifty cents. But I'm running ten percent all weekend. So get you some rubs. Get you a sticker. And we had some team koozies come in. So, and these are also on the website for, um, I think oh shit, these are 250. I didn't even put the stickers on the website, did I? No, I didn't. <laughs> damn. Anyway, anyway, damn. No, all right, hold on. These are on the website. I had a brain fart. I just did all the shit before I got on. So, all right. These are available, um, you know. But anyway, um, I'll put these on. I'll put these on after we... Uh, shit. God. I can't believe we didn't put them on the website. Anyway, we'll get them to you. So, I'll tell you what. Stickers are free this weekend. Place an order. I'll throw a dick sticker in there for free. I'll throw a dicker in there for free. Whatever. They're on the website. I'll throw a sticker in. What the hell? So, you know, what the, I'll give you something. So, and these are $2.50 on the website. Um, River Smokers, West Virginia, Koozies. Um, I was going to get the foam, like the, the, you know, the round ones, but man, they're, they're expensive. And I never bought merchandise before by bulk. And I've learned a lot of not to buy a lot of expensive shit. So <laughs> there we go. There's River Smokers, West Virginia, Koozie, $2.50. And for the other reveal, I don't know if I said, I don't think I mentioned this on my other live stream. Um, since we've talked, John, this is for you. Some clear. All right, now, this is what we can have done for you. All right, and what I'm about to show you is crazy. I work with Mr. Jason Savage. Right there, you see him. He's, uh, he's up there talking. Wave, Jason, so people know who you are. And um, he has a side business, um, him and his wifey. And they made me a River Smokers West Virginia 20 ounce tumbler cup. The only this is a prototype, but um, I have more. So we have more. So guys, these are these are on the website. Okay, yeah, old snap, you know it. Stop. All right, so. My buddy Jason at work, Jason as Savages AF Smoking and Grilling. Savages fuck. Yeah, Savages fuck. 
Smoking and Grilling made these for me, him and his wifey. He has a, his, they have a Facebook page. Jason, can you put the link up there for me so people can come check your stuff out? They can make any cup like this. I'm sure different styles of cup if you want. Um, but these are on my website for $30 a piece. I know it's a little salty. That's why I'm giving you a 10%. Um, on the weekend because it takes a little bit of money to make these. These aren't cheap to make. Um, this is a total surprise to me from Jason one day. It was on my desk when I went to work and I about fell over. So I ordered quite a bit. And so he's, uh, I'm getting them in um, daily. Um, so, you know, but they're coming in. So if you place, um, yeah, make mine savage. Go check me out on Facebook make mine savage and talk to him and his wife about um if you want your own competition cup or if you want any cup you need he can take it i'm telling you all right i'll explain it to you man this was a stainless steel metal cup when he started and because he's the shit this is what it looks like so on our website 10% off River Fun 2019 at richesriverbarbecue.com, bbq.com. All right. So, check him out on Facebook. They can do anything that you want to do with a cup like that. And he's pretty snazzy. So, yeah. He blew me away with it. Um, not a whole bunch. Yeah, not, I didn't expect it. I, I think it's awesome. You really, it's really high quality. Um, yeah. <laughs> I want to go name dropper. I'll let you drop a name. Yeah, his wife, his name is Lisa. Um, really nice people. John, yeah, nice cup. John, you can get one with 1984 barbecue on it. You can buy this one, whatever, or buy one off the website. Or, or you can get your contact them, man. I mean, these guys are awesome. I've known them for a little bit and, you know, they're just the side company, you know, just to get a little, you know, see what they can do. They love doing it. And, um, so Jason, if I'm missing something, put it in there. Um, but this is the thing. Um, if you don't have the cup they got in stock or I don't think they stock a particular cup, but you will have the pleasure of picking your own cup style you know, um, and really customizing it to your own, um, to, you know, to, or you want a 32 ounce tumbler, you want a, what do you call them? The, the short ones. He can pretty much do anything you want, man. So he's the man. Even if you don't have a sticker, she can work with her magic. Yes. She is very designful. Um, I wish I had, um, he has, I wish I had a, one of his cups. He has a barbecue catering. He's starting a barbecue catering business and he has, um, his cup. It's a fluorescent green. Um, and it says, um, I, I don't know what the fuck it says on it, but I mean, I can't remember, but it says like, <laughs> there's something about being savage and it's awesome looking. He uses it every day. Um, so, but the new ones, I, this was, this isn't, um, they're going to be a little different. The top on this one spins. Okay. This is a prototype. So the top on this one spins, but the new ones, they slide back and forth and they have a straw and they're the skinny 20 ounce tumbler. So, um, actually. No. Well, well could, I could show them. I mean, I don't think Tom watches this shit. Probably not. You got better things to do. I had some made for a barbecue competition guy of mine, that, uh, a friend of mine that's, there we go, 10, 32 ounce QZs, the picture on Facebook. There you go, guy. Plug your stuff away, Jason. Go ahead. And show them some love, guys. I mean, they do really good work. In fact, here's a new cup. I just had this made. I was trying to keep it in the bag. This guy might watch the channel. And I was going to try to keep it, um, you know, shh. The surprise him because he's helped me a bunch. He's the one that showed me how to cook on drums. He's the one that showed me how to. Sound like my wife, like my wife Savage. She does the same thing. Oh, no shit. That's cool, John. Hey, you know what? I don't have to order from Midwest. So, um, here is 
a barbecue team called Pulling My Money Muscle Competition Barbecue Team. He actually has been a really good mentor. You know, he's a really good guy. So this is the skinny one. Um, Mr. Savage forgot the straw. I got to pick up the straw hopefully tomorrow morning on the way to get the trailer. What's up from Oklahoma? Tom Jones. I thought that said George Jones. Like, what the hell? Hey, I uh, bought a bunch of your stuff from Heavenly. My son loves it. Gregory Miller, you know what? I love to buy stuff from Michael's website. Um, but next time, you can use River, richesriverbarbecue.com. I'm running a 10% to the end of the weekend. Um, so good. I'm, I'm glad your, your son loves it. Do you guys like it? <laughs> that The cup is nice. I like skinny and how tall it is. Um, Lewis, I'm telling you, you're actually... Um, what? I love you too. Good play. It's almost bedtime. So, yeah, Lewis, it's awesome. Um, let's see. The cup is nice. Um, the cup is nice. Look how skinny and tall. Yeah, I mean, it has a straw, but Mr. Savage forgot that shit this morning. Or was it yesterday? No, it was this morning. That's right. We're going to go get him. Hopefully, he'll be home tomorrow morning. We can stop by and get him. Maybe the way. Oh, he'll be awake. He's going to be making cups. Or I think I have some shit to do tomorrow or something. Um, copy that. I had a difficulty. Uh, beer influence. Night on your site. <laughs> oh, that's right. Well, I, did you blame it on old age? Yes. He blamed, yeah. on, being, he blamed yeah. on being 60. Now you're intoxicated in being 60. That just explains it all. Hmm. I'm playing with you. But, you know, so um, smash that thumbs up like button. And remember... Um, I will, we're going to be on for an hour. I'm going to try to make this an hour. Um, I don't know. We'll see. But go check out Make Mine Savage Facebook page, man. You can't go wrong with it. I will, um, yes, we will hook up in the morning for sure. Okay, good. Good. Um, cause we got to pick the truck up at like nine. Well, we got to be there at eight. So then, you know, got to be. We should be out by nine. I'm going to stop at my mom's grave and see her for a minute. And we'll be up, Jason. Um, I'll text you in the morning. Not early, but we head to Frederick. So, um, guys, again, you know, go ahead and order. If you want to order, I'll throw a sticker in for you. Um, I hate to sell stickers. I think they're, you know, they're a giveaway. But I got so much loot wrapped up in this stuff. It's pathetic. So here is the koozies. And, oh, the koozies and the stickers were made by Brant Williams at threadzone.com. He is also a barbecue competition team called Pig and Whiskey. Um, check our Facebook page. Um, they have a Pig and Whiskey barbecue competition page on Facebook. Check them out. He made our banner. He designed our logo. He made the stickers. He made the koozies. He, uh, what else we got going on? I'm trying to get some t-shirts, but I don't have a million dollars for t-shirts. So, and t-shirts are a little pricey unless you're buying like a thousand of them. And I don't know if I can sell enough t-shirts, um, to, to, uh, to do that. <sighs> Deflate. All right. All right, guys. So that's it. That's what's up. River fun 2019 is the promo code. Until now, until Monday or yeah, Monday at midnight. Um, yeah, the stickers are yeah, they're quality. I mean, I tell you, um, I've never had stickers made before, but I hate to peel it. I'm not gonna peel it away, but um, they're nice and thick, and they are plastically coated. You can see they have a little bit of a shine to them instead of a dull look. So there they are. Ah. Uh, God, Greg, really, Gregor? Are you really? Dude, God bless you. You're awesome. Um, that's not why I do this, but it's been a while since I've been on live, and you saw me come out with a couple of videos. The keto. Um, that's actually I was gonna do the keto because geez, uh, cheesy, cheesy E's kitchen uh, asked about a, a sugar-free barbecue sauce, so that's why I did the keto. And turn to find out. Um, dude, I'm on, I'm on a dance shit. tastes like shit. And I'm on a diet. Um, 
but nothing, nothing crazy. Always late to the party, but I can replay to catch up. Tom, I will catch you up. Tom, we're running 10% on the website, on everything on there. River Fund 2019. We have decals that are I'll throw in for free for now until I figure out how to charge you for them. And then <laughs> um, we got koozies on there for $2.50 a piece. Um, and then, of course, the rubs. Uh, you don't need to show you what the rubs look like because you know what they look like. And we're actually in the middle of changing the label on that. And I think here in the next uh, month, I think the product will not be available at heavenmadeproducts.com. Um, me and Michael said it's up to me. He wouldn't be upset at what. But um, I understand that, you know, I don't know. I haven't decided, but I might leave it on there. Uh, smoked salmon, how should I do it? Um, it's not unusual to go out with anyone. What? Huh? What does, what's that mean? I don't understand. I have no that idea. Uh, okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here. Uh, always too late. Okay. Um, anyway, Tommy, yeah, that's the, uh, all my, on the whole website till now, until Sunday, uh, Monday at midnight, um, River Fund 2019, all capital, put in there, baby. And, um, and you can, you know, get it. Oh, oh, oh and we had these made, Tom. Yeah, we had, uh, we had some tumblers, 20 ounce skinny tumblers with a straw. This is a prototype. Um, I just had the new ones out. Um, they're slide. Um, so, yeah, get you some. And I'm not after, you know, I, I just think it's cool. I've never really had swag to sell before. Um, no advice. Oh, I'm, I, well, hold on. Noodles. Give me a second. Um, no advice. <clears throat> I've never really smoked sand before. But I'm going to give you a little hint. Get my all-purpose rub, okay? You can sprinkle my all-purpose rub and put it on a cedar plank on your grill at about 250 degrees, 275, maybe even 300. And I'm telling you, that salmon is going to be good because I know a lot of channels that do it. I know a lot of people that um, has tried it. And they like it. I'm not a fan of salmon, um, so I'm more of a white fish kind of guy. Um, so, so um, yeah, that was a death stare. Miss Grace was trying to steal some limelight, so I gave her the stare of uh, go to your room and read a book. Uh, I use a hot smoker. Yeah, I mean, you can as long as you catch that fish at 145 degrees. If I'm, if someone correct me. But I cook fish to 145. So make sure you temp it. Leave the skin, skin side down on that plank. Or I didn't even use a plank. Um, I have a halibut video that we uh, did, which was phenomenal. I didn't have my rubs out that time. But I used um, another rub company's rub. And I put a little bit um, um, in their herb, herb um, infused pellets in a smoke tube. And I put it directly on the fire and it had the, um, the herb flavor from the, the smoke pellets and, um, and it was, it was good. Um, Miss Kate don't like fish, but I tell you what, that was the best fish I've ever had in my life. And I'm not saying just because I cooked it, but it is, was the best taste in fish that I, I had. Okay, yeah, I had one Weber kettle. I put it right on the grates, indirect. And I'll tell you, it don't take long. It didn't take, what, uh, maybe, what, 10 minutes. And that fish was done. Yeah. Bro, I got to go. Keep up the good work, man. I'll see you tomorrow. All right, Jason. Guys, go check out Jason's and his wife, Elisa's Facebook page at Make It Savage. If you want your own cup design, anything, like you saw, you know, anything they can do, you want, they can do. If you have a sticker, that's fine. If you want something fine, uh, something different, his wife can doodle on it on, on her computer um, and get it, they'll get it done for you. So go check them out. There you go, Jason. I'll see you in the morning, buddy. Thanks for everything, man. Look at Colorful Butterfly. I haven't seen you in a while. She's Colorful uh, uh, Butterfly was actually the one that I cooked the halibut for because she... Um, What's up, Louis Palomalo? What's up? Good night, noodles. I tried that fish. Anyway, um, I did the halibut for Colorful butter Butterfly because she wanted to do fish. So that's who that video was for. Um, 
So thank you. I did that. Uh, that was last year, last summer. Uh, or, I think so. It's been a while. It's been a minute. It's way back here. So go check out that. Um, da -da 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 -da. I'm trying to roll back through the messages here. I don't think. I, oh, uh, the best Tom Jones live at Galstonbury and tubu tubulate that. Okay, Tom Jones must have a. They have a channel. Never heard of that one. Never heard of that one. Oh, yeah, was my dream. Never heard of what? Uh, but I couldn't think fast enough. Right, Tom James, the song is not unusual. Okay, I got it, Greg. Tom James, the song is not unusual. No, okay, cool. All right, so it looks like we're caught up. Just about. All right, and I said night noodles. I had, I had a baby, so I don't have time to be on the internet. Oh, well, congratulations. Congratulations, colorful butterfly. We're having a baby. Boy or girl. So. Whew. Okay, anything else? I don't think so. You, you announced everything. Announced everything. Thanks, a girl. Cool. That's very awesome. Um, I right, guys, you guys want to ask me any questions or anything? You guys might want to know. I mean, you guys are usual faces, so you guys probably got to know me pretty good. Um, so, um, like I said, was uh, site wide 10% off River Fun 2019 at richesriverbbq.com. You'll find my koozies. Hold on, my koozies. Uh, you'll find my cups, which I think I'm going to get into the SCA. Any good advice? Um, yeah, don't ever cook your steak. <laughs> <laughs> good advice. Um, practice, practice, practice. Um, I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what's good on, what I'll use on my steak is Rich's River Dirt All Purpose. I'm not lying to you. I did a steak cook for the judges that was here on uh, the 9th. And they actually dug it. They like the steak. Um, so there you go. Just put Rich's River Dirt all purpose on it and grill it. And then you'll be perfect. Any advice? Um, trim it well. Um, um, make sure you get the cross, the cross hatches on there. Um, That's, that's my advice. Any more questions, John? Um, when you go hot and fast on a brisket, is your in, end temp usually higher than low and slow? No. It's the same temperature. I'm going to tell you something. I learned something from a competition guy um, that I was low and slow. I was low and slow at 250. And now I got my drums. I'm at 300, 310. Meat don't know what temperature it's being cooked at. So it's all about catching that internal temperature. If I cook a prime brisket for a competition or period, prime brisket, I will cook it to 210 to 213. And usually, excuse me, that's the mark that I want to hit. And I usually do pretty good with that. So, like again, remember, meat does not know at what temperature it's being cooked at. The only thing it knows is... um. Um, um, that it's being cooked. So hot and fast, I cook my brisket at 300. But the internal temperature is going to be the same at 213. So that's how I do it. And the actually, just take just take care of yourself, please. Do some walking exercises. You can't take care of wifey if you don't like take care of yourself. Um, yeah, we're on that. Thanks, Gregor. Um, thanks for your, you know, we're on it, buddy. Yeah, I just, it's a tough, it's really tough. So, Lewis. Yeah, I usually go 250, but I want to venture into hot and fast and some things. Run 300, run 325, run 350. Hell, run 400. <laughs> just watch it. You, um, you know, make the sure. The temp, the faster it cooks. Yeah, the higher the temp, the faster it cooks. It might give you a darker bark. It might burn it on the bottom, but keep that 
Congratulations on your engagement, guys. Oh, John, yeah, you left it out of the bag. I was going to do that. Um, yeah, I, I proposed to Katie yesterday at um, our, our dinner we had, um, and she said maybe. So, um, you know, if you guys have followed me on Facebook, you saw that, and thanks, John, um, <laughs> for bringing that up. Um, it was awesome talking. There's my buddy Scott Sinet. It was awesome to talk talking to you this week, Katie. He said some sweet things about you. Oh yeah, yeah. We we might have had our issues and shit. Who doesn't? But at the end of the day, she's my woman. She's my wife. She's gonna be my wife, and she's in this thing 100%. River dirt, river smokers. Got her 100% support as I give her 100% support, whatever she wants to venture into. And check her. And Miss Katie, she actually is really good with the camera. And um, Chris Stuckey at Bottle Cap Barbecue actually bought one of Miss Katie's pictures. Um, yeah, Jonathan, I'm sorry, man. Um, uh, we haven't seen I haven't seen you since Saturday. <laughs> feels left out. And yeah. He's like, dude, really? <laughs> get on him, John. Get on him. Oh man. Get him, Jonathan. Get him. Uh, you know, that, you know, Jonathan, man, I'm sorry, man. God damn. Um I with the with the blood pressure going and anxiety and I've been through a lot, man. I mean, really, I took this blood pressure thing and blew it across the river. And it was uncalled for. Um, my man Jonathan hooked me up with a juicer um, that I may use. I hope I'm going to use it. Um, but, I, you know, I, I don't know, man. Um, <laughs> there we go. Yeah. So, and, you know, and uh, what the hell am I rambling about? I forget. <laughs> Jonathan was giving you hell about that. Yeah, it got me all messed up. Um... So there's that. Um, okay. Um, I don't want to get all over the road here. I want to try to stay. Um, You're swerving. Yeah, I'm swerving pretty good. Um, yeah, hot and fast. Lewis, try that. In fact, if I see you, I want to see you Saturday. So let's make a point of hooking up. And we can, uh, you yeah, know, I'll, yeah. I'll bring you some. Uh, actually, did he go? Did Lewis ever order Rob's? Man, we'll figure it out. We'll hit me on Messenger yeah. afterwards. We'll talk. Um, I watched, um, thanks John on the engagement. I watched Cosmo's video today, hot and fast. He said to go to 210 or Turnbull Temp. I don't think you need to go to 210. Um, go to whatever is probe tender. Probe tender for me is 210 to 213. I'm telling you, I will lay my money on the bank. I will put my money in the bank on the brisket at 300 degrees, hot and fast at 210 to 213 degrees. Any more, you're going to overcook it, but you got to catch it. My comp briskets, 210 to 213, they're usually on point. Scott, in for the grill. One of my, one of my blue wrenches showed up. What up? What's up up there? And uh, he's up in Canada. He's uh, probably shoveling quite a bit of snow up there in the Vancouver district. So. QZE says, hey, what's up? You got a haircut. <laughs> yeah, I got a lot of things. I usually keep her... Hey, what's up, Food Porn Network? I usually try to keep it like this. I got like a skin fade. I've had it since high school, really. <laughs> I've really had this haircut for since I was 16 years old or younger. Um, So, um, yeah, what the fuck was I saying? I'm, I'm, my train of thought is all over the place, man. I mean... <laughs> Yeah. All right, super stoked for me and you guys. Okay, Jonathan. I'm sorry, Jonathan. Hit me up, Jonathan. Text me. I'll text you after the live stream. And uh, we'll kind of... I'll tell you what. Uh, Jonathan Havins has been... He's been, he's been a bro, man. He's been a fucking bro. And, um, and I'm going to be a bro for him. So there we go. You guys are simply awesome. I can't tell you... I can't tell that you... I can tell that you guys are real down-to-earth people and congrats on the engagement. Lewis, if I meet you tomorrow, you're going to see the real... You're going to see how down-to-earth we are. We are just... We are the Clampets, probably, pretty much. <laughs> um, <laughs> I wouldn't go as far as saying the Clampets. Not the Clampets, but we're in the 2019 version. What's going on, Food Porn Network? Uh, I can't remember your name. I'm sorry. 
uh, cheesy e. Yeah, I got a haircut, and uh, I, you know, that keto barbecue sauce that was for you, man. Check out Cheesy E's Kitchens channel. He, I mean, brand new. I mean, I don't even think I think I was a third subscriber or something. Maybe I don't know, um, or something. Third video, or whatever. I don't know something. Lou says he'll hit you up on Instagram if that's cool. Whatever, uh, Facebook, Instagram, whatever you want to hit me up on. Uh, you end up having my phone number at four. It's all over, so you can just text me if you want, Aaron, a little bit or whatever you want to do. Um, Scott, what's up, guys? Is cooking with somebody? Cooking with Corey. What's up, Corey? Um, check out Corey's channel up in, uh, he's in Nebraska out there with, uh, Dan with Smoky Goodness. I'll leave every, everybody's a YouTube. I'll, I'll try to leave your channel in the link description box. So guys, just showing up. Okay. Just showing up. I got some stickers in. Okay. These are not for sale, but however, um, if you, uh, want one, um, hit me up personally and I will give you one. Or if you make an order on the website, I'll give you a sticker. And we're running a summer river, uh, river fun 2019 promo code. And we have shit. Yeah, you losing shit now? We have shit. We have here's, shit. here's koozie. We have river smokers, West Virginia barbecue team koozies. Um, uh, and we have, um, 20 ounce tumblers. Um, this is a prototype. This is a turn one. Um, and the new ones are slide, um, and these are $30 off my website, but I'm running a 10% code, uh, for the whole weekend. Um, so get you some rubs, get you a koozie, get you a tumbler is to hold your hot coffee or your strong, cold adult beverages. And it comes with a straw. It's just Mr. Savage didn't give me a damn straw today. I had to get that tomorrow morning. So what? What's up? I wonder if I'm going to have stuff to take pictures of tomorrow while we're out. Take your camera. That's what I'm thinking. I'm wondering if I got the Yeah, I'd take that. I'd take it. That's why I bought it. Well, I don't know. Uh, send me and Kim one of those stickers and tumblers. <laughs> Michael Petrie, what's up, brother? What's happening? Uh, Yeah, Rich, I'll hit you up on Instagram. Is that cool? Yes. Hey, Corey. Gary. I'm sorry, Gary. I, I, um... I'm sorry I don't get to check you out a whole bunch, man. Um, I'm subscribed to a bunch of them, and I, I sometimes I get to you. And it's been, I haven't watched much of anything uh, the last week and a half because I've been dealing with the high blood pressure, kind of feeling out of sorts. The medications got me kind of, you know, I've changed some lifestyles, um, you know, as far as eating and stuff like that. And um, some other extracurricular activities I gave up, which is very, very helpful. Um, so guys, I do appreciate everything for hanging in there with me. We're almost 2,400 subscribers. We're at 2,371. And, um, that, that's just surreal for me. I mean, hell. So again, we're on that, um, um, we're on that web, that summer, uh, river, river, summer fun, not yet. River fun, 2019 at com. And we'll give you 10% off on your order, and I'll throw in a I'll throw in a sticker. So, Scott, that add a boy more water, lay off the soda. We want you to be happy and healthy. So I haven't, I have never been. I, I like drinking sodas, but I've never really slammed sodas a whole bunch. But yeah, that's my job. Um, yeah, she drinks it by the case. <laughs> but yeah, we're in the little clear. So, yeah. Oh, Scott, by the way. Um, I went in yesterday and blood pressure was still, it was a couple points high because I got excited and anxious. Um, they gave me a, a third pill. Um, so, and, um, editing videos. All right, John, that's cool. Yep. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, mate, John. Okay. All right. I'm trying to lose weight to eat too. Just eat small portions of food, but instead of three meals, make it five. It works. Yeah, I've, I was on a diet plan uh, a while back, and I've done really good with it. Um, but I was, you know, I spent a lot of money on protein mixtures and stuff like that. But we're gonna do it. Hit me up personally if you want, to, if you want some merch. I can make lots of different stuff. Um, sorry, cheesy. I, I have a, a merchant maker already. Um, his guy designed my logo. Um, makes it more convenient to do that. Um, but you know, guys, cheesy. Hit him up, and. Um, Mr. Make Mine Savage at Make Mine Savage on Facebook made my Tumblr for me. 
Um, he's making all my tumblers. Um, and this was a, you know, stainless steel cup. And, and he did wonders with it, man. So there it is. These are on sale from my website at $30. But I gave it a 10% off on everything on the website until Monday. I know it's a little salty, guys. And I'm sorry. I really feel bad. But these things cost almost 20 bucks to make. Um, and those who know that USPS raised their damn shipping to $8.00. I'm not going to change that. I'm leaving mine at $7.25. I can't do it. I, I, $0.75 cents isn't going to kill me. So I'm, I'm not going to do that shit. So I'm going to do some glass cutting boards for my channel once I throw them. Well, I'd go ahead and do it, really. I'd put it on there. Go ahead and get her done, man. Throw your style. I'll, I'll plug you. Just um, uh, glass, glass cutting boards. Make their own glass. Do you do glass etching by chance? That's fun. That's good looking stuff. The yeah, glass etching. Glass etching's cool. Yeah, that's pretty I tried cool. It once or twice. Um, Corey, yeah, I'm hoping to be at three thousand. Um, I hope. But uh, like I said, we're gonna oh, we're gonna go ahead and you know, um, we're gonna like I said, man. The YouTube channel this year is probably made doll a good edge. <laughs> um. I don't know. That's a good question. Okay. Anyway, um, we are still going to put out, um, oh, and yeah, um, check out Duke's Premium Meats. Um, he's a guy that now, um, you know, I wouldn't say he, he supports my YouTube channel. He supports the channel and he has sent me a rack of meat. So, um, you'll see me plug them and, but you're going to see a lot of competition videos SCA cooks videos and we're going to gear our videos more towards the competition side this year So I don't stress myself out because we're actually going to try to do two comps a month And that's going to be that's going to be enough stress on me as it is to get that done. So um, I'm just going to not cut back, but I'm going to try to bring a better quality video um, We're going to be farting around with Miss Katie's camera a little bit more that is really technically technologically advanced for us. Um, we are not technologically advanced, advanced. people. <laughs> I can't um, figure out how to shrink my pictures. Right. So, yeah. So, anyway, we're working on it. That's the that's the that's the 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 um, the, the flow of the channel for this year. Um, and of course, you guys, I can't. I'm just make sure you guys know. Ten percent off. River Fun 2019, everything on the website. We got the big K's glaze. We got my rubs on there. Um, and oh shit, can you go give me that bag off the the bag of what Michael sent me? Yeah. So Michael, uh, me and Michael have been in discussion of, and you seen, might have seen. Uh, I think it's Ken. Ken, I think up at um, shit, heavy metal barbecue up in to the Pittsburgh area. Um, so I asked Michael um, to come up with a little bit of uh, uh, like a mop seasoning. So here is, in testing now, it doesn't look real right, it's in the Ziploc baggie, right? Mm -hmm. This is some good shit right here. Y'all get you some of this. This will guarantee to jack you up. Uh, anyway. Um, <laughs> yeah. So this is our new mop seasoning we're trying out. Um, I'm going to give it a try. Um, as soon as I found I had high blood pressure, my this came in the mail. I'm like, well, it's got some salt. So we're going to try it out little by little. And I have um, I have a guy that uh, is you know, going to help me try it out. Very cool. I'll be, I'll be shigging. I'll, I'm going to learn from you. Well, you're going to learn the wrong shit probably, Scott. You know that. You did better. You did better than we did. So anyway... Here's our, um, our end testing now is our river water, which will be, you can add this to one quart of apple cider vinegar um, or whatever you want. I'm sure it's good on anything. I haven't tried it. I've tried it out of the bag, just a dab. It is, uh, anything that comes from Michael is gonna be top notch. So this is a, t it's very good, high quality ingredients in it. So, and give Michael's channel, a ch uh, Michael's channel, give Michael's website a see if you don't and never have heavenmadeproducts.com. 
you'll find his products on there. You'll find my river dirt on there as well. And, but you won't find this on there. So this isn't on my website. We're not packaging yet. Like I said, we're in testing. I want to do one for pork and I want to make sure that um, this might be good for um, beef too, for brisket. Just something, something to play with. Uh, I like coming up with new stuff. It's pretty good. Pretty, pretty cool stuff. So, so anyway, what we got going on? I've been talking. Oh, very cool. I'll be shaking and learning from you. Okay, no problem. I'll have to check out your channel. I'm not ever on YouTube. Let's see. Totally after that, after the stream, I will. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I just checked out his channel. I mean, um, there's a couple videos there. Um, but I, I tell you what, you're on the right track. Um, just ordered my Tumblr, buddy. Can you please send me an extra sticker? I would appreciate that. Um, absolutely. I will send you two stickers, Cornelius Bass. Hey, didn't he just, you know what, Cornelius, uh, actually, uh, yeah, didn't he just... Yeah, you just, yeah, okay, all right, yeah, okay. Oh, man, dude, it's, I'm getting, I'm getting scrambled. I'm getting a little tired, and, you know, I'm getting fatigued easy right now. These blood pressure meds, man, are, are, they're not really jacking me up, but they're going to make me tired, you know, after a while. So, oh, red in the face. Yeah, oh, that's a bad yeah. color. I'm yeah. paranoid. Ugh. Anyway, you got to walk that's this with me. <laughs> Um, yes, Cornelius, man, thank you for the support, Cornelius. Um, you've been with me for a while, and I'll tell you what, man. I'll send, yeah, I'll do that for you. Check out Tedshi, Tedshi Trucks Band, Midnight in Harlem, the live version, Kathleen. Yeah, yeah, okay, she'll check it out. <laughs> She's a music buff. Um, I kind of like, um, country and stuff, but, uh, I'm all over the place. I've got it. I tell you what, man, my mom used to love the soundtrack to Grease. <laughs> and I've been wearing it out. Because I like I like that movie and whatever. <laughs> anyway, guys, new if you're new, if, if you just start watching, give me a thumbs up. We got some tumblers for sale. 10% off on my website, River Riches River BBQ.com. And um and you know, I'll throw in a sticker for the weekend. You buy a, a you, know, you buy one. I'll you know, some of the website this weekend. I'll throw a sticker in. We got koozies. So ten percent off River Fun. Yes, I do. Two thousand nineteen. Yes, I do. yes, she does. <laughs> yeah, Scott. She has this purple speaker. It's about this big. It's right there. Yeah, it's a purple speaker. It's, it's about purple, this it's big. Pink. Whatever. And that son of a bitch makes the house shake. Here we yeah. sit. All right. If you're not familiar with this contraption, <laughs> it is a speaker, Bluetooth capable, uh, and it, and it thing hammers down. I mean, this this some bitch makes the windows rattle. So you'll hear this at competitions. Yeah, you'll hear this Either competition. screaming five finger death punch or grease soundtrack. <laughs> there's no in the mood for. there's no <laughs> variation there. <laughs> Ivan Moody to Richie Valens maybe. So anyway, that's what it is. I got a jet. The boy is fixing pitch, pitching a uh, fit. See you later. After, see you later, everyone. Cheesy East Kitchen. Thanks for stopping by. You know, everybody, check out Cheesy East Channel. Um, Cheesy East Kitchen Channel. They're they're fairly new. I mean, just just hit him up, show him some love, and he'll be on his way. Thanks, Cheesy East. Thanks for the support. Yeah, I do rock. I <laughs> Way. Confused Thanks, people. buddy. Grease soundtrack is cool. Not cool. I'd play it now. They might want revenue. Right. Thanks, buddy, and no problem. Um, the family and I enjoy all your videos, and rubs are awesome. Thank you, Cornelius. I'm glad you enjoy the rubs, and thank you for supporting the channel, and thank you for everything you've done. And I want to say years now, because I think you've been part of me about from the beginning. Yeah, I think he's been with, yeah, us, for he's been with us for a while. So thank you so much, guy. Uh, I gotta get supper going. Catch you later, Corey. Thanks for stopping by, Corey. Hey, check out everybody. If you haven't heard of Core Cooking with Corey, 
go check out Corey's channel, Cooking with Corey on YouTube. On the YouTube. Uh, he's out in Nebraska. He does a lot of um, nice stuff. I mean, he does a, he's a real down-home guy like us here. You know, what you see is what you get. He's a real good guy. And he got some good damn food on there, too. Go check him out. So, yeah. And then also running a 10% um, off code, River Fund 2019. 10% on everything on the website, including our new koozies. Our rubs, which uh, we're in the middle of changing the label. So hopefully we're going to sell the rest of our rubs that have the la old label. And we're going to have a new label. These are the tumblers that are for sale on my website. $30 with a 10% discount on everything. This is a prototype. Uh, the one that I have on the website will not have this. It has a slide and it comes with a straw, straw which this one does not come with a straw. And this is a prototype, so, you know. That's that's just yours. Yeah, my coffee intake cut way back, so I don't even drink, I don't even drink a third of that. So, that's guys. I drink the other four cups for you. <laughs> right. So, I don't know. How long, how much longer do you think I have to stay on? Oh, 8 o'clock. Mm -hmm. We got to get up in the morning, and we're going to get our barbecue trailer tomorrow. So, it's going to be, a, hopefully it's going to be early night, but I don't, I don't know. What you got? What you got? Oh, it's Brandy. Uh oh. Oh, uh, Brandy, where you at? Mm -hmm. you, uh, what? I think she she might have just got home from the hospital or something. She oh, yeah. viewing. Ooh, yeah. Fuck that shit. Any questions for me, guys? Any, anything you might want to know? Um, you know, about cooking or anything? Life? Life. We're ready to get off here in a minute. I'll watch it later. <laughs> I guarantee you. You got pics of the new Q? Hmm? New Q. Pics of the new Q. What do you mean? What do you mean, Gregor? I don't have pictures of my boxes from Saturday or nothing, though. Or, I mean, I don't have any pictures of the new style of barbecue. Um, yeah, Brandy's all like, what? What do you mean you're on live? What? What? <laughs> Where? What? When? <laughs> I'm like, uh, right now. Fantastic. Really excited for you about our your new competition rig. I hope you will be happy with it. Oh, the barbecue truck. No, it's it's not um it's not a porch trailer, it's not a concession trailer. It's simply just a six by twelve box trailer. Um, but it, it was from an old barbecue uh, team that decided they wanted to not get in not stay in the barbecue competitions. Sorry. And they um, put their trailer for sale, and um, I bought it, and it comes loaded with all their stuff. Um, um, Lou's kind of I'll just let the coupon down. But you know what? This is what they say about coffee. Coffee, if you drink coffee, a regular coffee drinker, it should not affect your blood pressure. If you're a new coffee drinker, they say it could affect your blood pressure until you get used to the coffee. Google has been my friend for blood pressure. Soda, coffee, and nicotine. <laughs> Crack. <laughs> I, got, I got all three of the worst things you could have. Coffee and espresso. I love it all. Well, I'm I a, like butter pecan iced coffee. Now that, or white chocolate iced coffee. That sounds pretty good. <laughs> yeah. So. With, the, with at least one or two espresso shots. <laughs> Good figure. Huh? I'm a caffeine fiend. She loves her caffeine. I'm sorry, guys. Man. Uh, yeah, you, if you want to, Gregor, um, you can send me some coffee. But um, we have a um, coffee company we get. It's called Caveman Coffee Company out in New, New Albuquerque, New Mexico. I think it's uh, some of the USC fighters like Keith Jardine. And uh, some of them's got their mitts in that. Um, what's up, Brandy? What's going on? Um, so, so, yeah. But send it, you know, I'm, I'm all about trying new stuff. I'm sorry, guys. That me blood pressure medicine make me tire a little bit. Um, so, anyway. I mean, I, I hate to go.
It never notified me. Go to bed. Oh, don't worry. <laughs> He'll be in bed here about another hour and a half. Yeah. About, I don't know, about 9.30. We got to get up at, well, I get up at 5.30 every morning to get to work, but. Okay, um, 10 o'clock is when we'll go to bed. Probably 10, 10.30. 10 o'clock. 10, 10.30. 10 o'clock. Whatever. You can go to bed at 10 o'clock. <laughs> How are you all? Well, we're good. We're good, Brandy. Thanks for asking. Um, I'm sure you, you and Katie's been talking about, um, you know, on the messenger about what, <gasps> fuck, <laughs> about what's going on uh, here at the house. Uh, run, run, produced, made by vets, all USA coffee. Oh, okay. Cool. I'll try it. I support a local um, vet organized, vet company that actually, um, um, makes the honey here in West Virginia um, for, from several wildflowers from the wild wonderful. Brandy, I have high blood pressure. If Katie hasn't told you, no, I, I have high blood pressure. Um, just started my third med today and it's coming down. Plus I starved myself for a week and a half. Lost 21 pounds last week in three days. Um, so... But yeah, that's that's what we're what we're facing here at the house. My tooth bothering me a little bit right here. I get a little bit of a headache from that because it's pissing me off. Did you want Advil? I meant to ask you. I don't know if I could take that. I don't think it would. Wait a minute. Well, that's the that's the Paxil it might fuck with. I can't tell you from taking headache pills. I mean, shit, we gonna do lay there. What's the backstory to the old man photo on the wall? Oh, the guy, uh, that is... Well, the, well, okay, well, the old man, I'm not going to be, I'm, 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 I'm hoping I didn't take that wrong. I'm hoping you're asking with, with politeness. That is Miss Katie's um, past grandfather, Papa Joe. Um, he is a veteran of... Um, he was the Army... Army Air Corps before they went to the Air Force. Yeah, he was. In, uh, v was he Philippines or Vietnam? He, Philippines. No, okay, that's cool. No, no problem. I, I know you wasn't trying to be offended. I, I, I didn't offend me. Uh, you know, it's just uh, that guy right there. That's Katie's grandfather that um, passed away last October. No. Yes. Yes, last October. October um, we were fixing to go down and see him. He was in his 90s. He was like 90, 90? He was 90. He was going to be 91 this year. Yeah, he lived yeah. a long life. He had a lot of, he had heart attacks and strokes and he open heart surgeries. I mean, he, he's been, he was through the mill. So that's, um, actually it's Kathy's dad. And, um, you know, so, and I, you know, I know it's like to lose a parent. And I know Kathy is trying to find a way to, iron that out in herself and it bugs miss katie a lot that her grandfather's gone um just like it bothers me a lot and here's um jesus i'm sorry for your loss he looks like a lovely man you know what i never met the guy he was awesome but he was i'm a good guy. here i hear he was he was badass i lost my mother right there this past october well past september 26th and we buried her on October October days October, after my October 6th. Yeah, a couple a year days later. A year later yeah. after my grandfather. Yeah. Um so between the high blood pressure and me being fat and not listening and not wanting to eat, like just throwing crap into my body, I really didn't care. So, you know, whatever. So my mom was on her, you know, mom got really sick and I lost her and uh and it messes with me still today. And uh, have anxiety from it. And, uh, so then the anxiety um, made my blood pressure go up even more. And then um, when I found out I had high blood pressure, it just crazy blew my mind wide open. Um, yeah, I'm on medication for anxiety. Um, for my psych psychosis. I don't know what that is. But um, anyway, you know, long story short and all that stuff, I don't want to get all, you know, worked up over it. But uh, 
anxiety got worse and when she died and uh, just trying to cope with it and it's it's tough so you know thanks to her i'm able to do this kind of stuff if you, if you read between the lines i'm able to do this so i owe everything i do to my mother so that's where it's at Yeah, it sucks losing people. Yeah, it does. Yeah, I'm on medication for anxiety. I'm on Paxil. Um, and some, yeah. I think you should be able to be able to take it. Yeah, I don't know. So, that's where I'm at with it. So. Refresh not working. Camera probably lost power. Um, no, I'm still up and running. I don't, I don't know what he's talking about, but, uh. We got, uh, we're on the river, man. Um, some of the stuff is, uh, it gets kind of crazy. Uh, service is up and down sometimes. Um, okay. You just cleared up. Did it? Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah, because it's not spinning anymore. Okay. I finally came back in. It was probably being on the river and... Freaking signal bouncing off the wrong satellite or something. Oh, Lord. Aliens. <laughs> Aliens, there it is. New there world is. order. Aliens. I'm going to run outside and capture them. I don't even want to mention the conspiracy theory on this channel. Gregor says, Welcome back. <laughs> I didn't go anywhere. Mm -hmm. My screen will spin too if it stops yeah, doing really its thing. Stopped, yeah. Yeah. Hey, why don't you guys uh, brush your teeth? God, Jason Grace. Clean up. Okay. Clean up. Brush teeth. All right, guys. So here we go. Family's fixing to go to bed. I'm fixing to go relax, take a shower, get ready for tomorrow. We're going to go pick up our trailer. I will make a video on going to Jersey. I think we're going to look uh, hook up with Louis um, Kalamatis. I hope so anyway. Oh, hey, I've got people coming. I'm going to sign off. Yeah. Every, all right. I'll stay on for a little bit longer, guys. I hate to. I see you guys are starting to come on. We were down to four. I was going to get off, but um, we have um, um, we got merch in. We have stickers um, available. Um, I will, of course, these are available if you make a. Uh, these aren't for sale, but I will give you one in your order if you make it over the weekend. I have a coupon code running River Fund 2019 on my site. Riches River. Um, river, riches, <laughs> river bar, riches, river .com. Um, we have cuties on there for sale. Um, we have our tumblers are in with our, um, no, we don't have, no, we don't have t-shirts yet, Brandy. Um, those might be a bit. Those might be a bit. Those are a little salty. Uh, I can only get them in like, um, like a, like a thousand shirts. <laughs> And uh, you do the math. Uh, that's expensive. That's a lot of money. So, um, okay, there's our tumblers. Thirty dollars for our tumblers online, or twenty ounce. This is a prototype. This has a spin lid. Our new ones have the the slide with a straw. Um, so, there you have it. Um, the ten percent discount is for everything on the website. Get you some, and I will send you a sticker. Um, for your with your order um because you know I, I don't know I, I mean i'm not real big on marketing you know i'm not really a big marketing guy but that's pretty cool huh yeah they are cool like i like how fucking tooth is missing <laughs> and the guy told me because it says this you have to have that that's what he told me <laughs> he's a good friend of mine uh check his face he, uh, all right i had these made at threadzone.com it's a, he's legit. He is the shit. I mean, he is the man. He has a barbecue competition team called Pig and Whiskey. They were just the KCBS Invitational. He's got fourth place calling chicken out of like a million teams. And um, go check out their Facebook page, pigandwhiskey.com, or Pig and Whiskey on Facebook. Uh, 
da, 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 da. And Miss Katie actually, um, she sells pictures too uh, on her Facebook. I think it's Cat's Crazy Creations at, on Facebook. Yeah, Cat's Crazy Creations. K's, not, it's Cat's K, Cat with a K, Crazy with a K, and creations, creations with a K. So everything is K, K. So <laughs> go check them out and message you. You can hit her up on her Facebook, on her, her, her page, and you guys can discuss. I mean, we can have pictures of everything, and she is the shit with a camera. Um, so check her Facebook oh, out. And the guy that makes, the guy that made the logo is Thread Zone, but the guy that actually made these koozies for me is a guy I work with named Jason and his wife, Lisa. And you can check their Facebook out where they make these on their Facebook page at Make Mine Savage. Um, cause he has a barbecue channel called Savage as Fuck Grilling, Smoking and Grilling. He don't put many videos on there, but he's also coming out with a catering business called, uh, I think Savage Barbecue. And a, a <laughs> real good friend of mine, uh, he works with me. Um, he surprised me one morning with a koozie. I gave him a sticker when they come in a while back and he made this for me. It was all... Um, aluminum cup. He he made it, dipped it in some sort of uh, shiny stuff for two four four weeks, and um, <clears throat> and that's our finished product. So guys, I do if you decide to go on the website and purchase, you get ten percent and you get a sticker. <coughs> <coughs> and the rubs I'm using are our competition. So hopefully that we'll have a competition rub that's worth saying it's, you know, competition worthy. So anything else? You've already gone back over everything, right? I feel like I have, yeah. Apple, you do not need to sleep. Yeah, we're going to get into SCA Cooks. Uh, tomorrow we're going to get our trailer. It's nothing. It's not a barbecue Porsche trailer or nothing. Nothing fancy. Wants to see the cup. Can you show it again? It'll cost her. <laughs> All right, look. There's the tumblers. The, it's a, our new ones. Are, um, let's see. All right. Daddy Dutch. Hold on. Hold on, John. Oh, what? Daddy Dutch. I heard a rumor that someone... We know is getting hitched. I don't know who the hell you're talking about, Ken. <laughs> like, who are you talking about? Congrats. Who, who are you talking about? You just heard. Where are you at from? Word <laughs> spread that fast? You're eight <laughs> states away. All right, Jonathan, here is the actual cup. This is a prototype. You know that. You've seen this on Saturday um, when you was here. Um, but, okay, here is the actual, our new cups. It is a hog brand. It is a skinny 20 ounce tumbler. And um, this is why I had this made for a friend of mine. And our new ones um, slide and they have a straw that goes in there. But Mr. Savage forgot the straw and he gave me these cups. So we'll be getting that. And this is for a barbecue competition team real fast. Woo! That I made I made for because um, you know, he's been a real, real big part of my competition stuff. Along with another guy that, that, you know, that Red Valley Barbecue, Sean Moffat. So, there it is. That's the new one, Jonathan, but it's, it has our logo on it. Um, right there. And by the way, um, you just purchased a cup. Um, it'll be in the mail um, probably... Tuesday, because well, we're not gonna be here tomorrow. You know, I have to put it in the mail. Actually, be in the mail Monday, I think. So, there's our new coos. Uh, our well, here's our. Here's what's gonna look like. Is our image on um, a tumbler, and they're thirty dollars with a ten percent discount, and I'll throw in a sticker, and we got koozies. And um, that's it. We search, um, search a little salty. They're going to be a minute. So. 
right there. All right, guys, I'm getting off of here. It's been 80 minutes. We're going to go ahead and bounce. Kids are ready to go to bed. I'm going to take a shower. We got to do some business tomorrow. So, um, guys, again, I'm, a, I'm this last time I mentioned, I'm running to the ground. Tom Petty's site just posted a new old song. Real <laughs> Lewis, don't forget to hit me up when we get off the live stream, and we'll uh, we'll take care of that. Um, hey, Daddy Dutch, Ken, thanks for stopping by, buddy. Um, you know, love you guys. And, uh, yeah, thanks for the, you know, me and Katie, if you didn't know, I proposed to Katie, um, yesterday uh, evening at dinner and, uh, she said maybe. So we'll see what she really decides. Um, what the hell is that? Uh, yeah, well, whatever. Uh, yeah, it's whatever. whatever. It's whatever. So, um, guys, you know, Hey, you know, check it out. Check out my bar, check out the website, richesriverbarbecue.com, like Katie just put there. Use the promo code. It's good until Monday at midnight. So, oh, Sarah, did Sarah say something? No, Sarah says she likes the new logo, and I was just saying thanks, Sarah. Sarah wants to see the, oh, okay. You're, yeah. I, oh, okay, well, anyway. All right, guys, so, you know, Check the check the channels out. I'll, I'm trying to put them channels in the description box, guys. They're up and down the feed. Uh, Daddy Dutch, Daddy Dutch cooking. He's one of them. Um, so guys, bear with me. You know, I'm dealing with the blood pressure. Um, still gonna put videos out. Still gonna keep coming to you guys. Not gonna forget about nobody. Just life is happening as usual. And guys, I, I can't say guys enough. So thanks for everything. We're gonna bounce off of here. You know, she said. <laughs> I did not but say maybe. She said yes, but I'm just I'm trying to be you know I'm being a jokester. So he's trying to get me started. Yeah. So anyway, uh, blah, 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 there it is. Uh, <laughs> do you even smoke, bro? Yeah. Well, I smoke food. <laughs> I smoke. What are you talking about? Who are you? Let's see. We got somebody new. <laughs> Dirty. Dirty or catfishing. Well, yeah, I smoke. I got plenty of videos saying I smoke. Check them out. <laughs> Thanks for seeing. It'll be awesome. Yeah, please hit me up on Instagram. Oh. I'm waiting for this dirty or guy. What's in the smoker now? Nothing. It's Friday night. Um, getting ready to put the kids to bed and getting ready to go get my uh, competition trailer tomorrow. So, um, good night, two step. So we got, uh, some smoking video. We got a lot of smoking videos on there, man. Check them out. I've been doing this shit. Got 260 some videos out and nine, nine times out of 10. They're smoking. So, and guy, oh, hey guys, my 270 smokers for sale. Just so you know. Um, so guys, anyway, I'm gonna get off here. I got shit to do. I'm gonna call it a night. Um, share with your friends and family and thanks for the love. And all my social media links are in the description box. Hit show more down there. If you feel like donating to the channel, there's just, there's a PayPal link down there. I don't expect it. No, $600. Um, Ken, for you, maybe, maybe, well, I tell you what, Ken, just for you. Kent, I'll give you a special family discount of twelve hundred dollars. All right. So anyway, I'm out of here. Um, so share with your friends and family, and when you do share with them, tell them the best barbecue comes from the river. And we'll see you on the next one. Remember, stress free. I'm gonna try to two step. Tell Miss Katie, don't stress me out. Excuse me. Yeah, hey, we're gonna go on that one. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Where's that? I don't know.